Hey guys, how's it going? So I hope everyone's doing good. Uh, it's been a very busy uh, month uh, for me so far. Uh, for some of you already know, but for those of you who don't, I've been uh, really busy on uh, working on uh, a documentary about my life and uh, with a couple uh, friends of mine. And uh, it's been going uh, pretty good so far. Um, and uh, part of the process was that uh, I had to, well, uh, uh, like a slideshow of pictures were put together uh, of, you know, kind of throughout my life. And um, so I had to uh, kind of, I had to sit through the, um, the, like the slideshow of the pictures throughout my whole, basically throughout my whole life. And um, so I'm sitting there and I'm watching it and I'm, I'm like having like a really, you know, blast from the, pla blast from the past type uh, feeling. And um, there were some pictures in there that were definitely like an eye awakening and like emotional because, um, you know, a lot of the pictures in there were, you know, just like, wow, like just a lot of good uh, stuff that that I was really lucky to be a part of and, and have. Um, well, you know, as a, as a child, you know, I, you know, with a lot of different family vacations and different things I got to do and people that, you know, the amount of people that really, uh, you know, were, were uh, there for me, uh, making sure that I, you know, was, uh, you know, taken take care of and also uh, made sure that I, you know, kind of lived the best normal uh, childhood uh, possible. Um, so yeah, that was emotional. Uh, you know, a lot of a lot of pictures of, you know, me and my family all, uh, you know, just doing different stuff and, um, you know, sometimes um, when you go through things in your life, you don't necessarily always remember like all the good. You tend to like, you know, think a lot of the bad because sometimes the bad uh, things can just really uh, take over uh, the good times. And uh, I remember um, seeing a picture of me and my friend uh, Harrison, which uh, I had... I, I, I don't, I completely, I'll be honest, I completely forgot about that, about him and about the the friendship, the friendship that we used to have. And I remember, I was, I don't even, I think I was in kindergarten or grade school, one of the two. Anyway, we were really good friends. He was uh, physically uh, disabled as well. Uh, he was in a wheelchair as well, so... You know, him and I kind of, of course, instantly bonded uh, and just became really good friends. And we talk and laugh and, you know, hang out and do stuff. And, and uh, anyway, uh, he ended up uh, getting sick. Uh, well, he he went to a different school. That's what that's what came first is that we... He went to a different school, and then, you know, life kind of, you know, happened, and then uh, it, it just, it was what it was. Um, but I think we were still friends, but we just, we also went to the same uh, physical therapy, so I think we still kind of saw each other uh, there as well uh, sometimes. But um, I remember, I, I do remember uh, there were a few times well. He just kind of disappeared, you know, and I remember thinking, wow, you know, I wonder, you know, where he's at or, you know, what he's, what, uh, what's going on, you know. But, uh, you know, again, life happened and I was going, 
going through so many medical stuff and surgeries. I, I didn't even, I totally just forgot. And anyway, uh, I think it was like a few months later, I had found out that he was sick. Um, and that's why I had not seen him around. And, um, but I thought, you know, no big deal. You know, people get sick all the time and I know what that's like. So and I, I always bounce back. So I, I remember thinking that he'll, you know, come around again. Well, I think a few more months passed, um, uh, and, uh, I had been, uh, told that, um, by, uh, my mom, because I guess the physical therapist or therapy had told her, uh, told my mom to tell me, and I guess she had passed away. Uh, I think I saw, even saw a picture of him in the paper, I think. It was so long ago. I, I, so I have little memory, very little memory, but I do remember, you know, how much we hung out and how much we really just, you know, had a good time together. And I think, you know, as I said, I, you know, sometimes when you're going through things in your life and you just, you know, a lot of not so good things are happening and, and it can really, um, you know, take over the, the, the bad can take over the good. And, and, uh, so that was definitely emotional. I didn't expect to see, uh, that, uh, picture of me and him, um, hanging out, uh, laughing again, so that was, um, yeah, that was, that was a little, little rough, um, but I know that, um, he's, um, I know that he would have been doing really great things, uh, if he was still with us today, so, um, uh, yeah, it, it just, you just never really know. You know, I mean, life just, you never know when, what's going to happen or, I mean, I think for, the f like, for, I mean, he was like my very first uh, friend ever, I think, and, uh, you know, back then in school. Uh, I remember he was the only guy that, you know, kind of talked to me and, you know, it just became real, real good uh, friends. And that was also the first time that, you know, when he, when he passed away, that was the first time I had experienced any kind of, like, you know, death or, or knew what that was. Um, so it, it, it was, uh, like I said, it was, it was definitely uh, a little rough uh, and, and good. I'm glad that I saw it, you know, as well as many other pictures that were shown. I'm glad that I, you know, saw that and... and um, you know, I hope, um, you know, I hope that, uh, that he's, you know, at a, you know, that he's, that he's, uh, up there, uh, you know, in a happy place or something, or, you know, that he's, you know, I know that he's, you know, not suffering anymore, so that's, that's always good. Uh, anyway, I just wanted to share that. Uh, but uh, things are going well. Uh, big things are coming. Uh, can't wait to share it all uh, with you. Uh, I'm having, to, I have to, been having to keep my mouth shut. I still do, but uh, you know, because I'm like, I want to tell you all about it. You know, a lot more right now because it's, you know, like I said, you know, really good things are coming. So, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll get lit, we'll get lit done, so, uh, but anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, don't forget to, uh, follow me on, uh, YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, uh, just, you know, sharing, sharing my life with everybody, and showing you how I live, and what I like to do, and also, I, you know, I also have my, my own, uh, website as well, so, uh, you know, feel free to check that out too. It's uh, mattbudjack dot com, uh, and uh, yeah. So, thanks for watching.